Frankie, knock it off. Oh my god. Look what my cat just did to my Mario box. Frankie, knock it off! Just did... My cat just ate up my complete Mario boxes. Are you seeing this? Oh my goodness. Frankie! This is who did it. She's... It's hard to be mad at, but... She's got to be in every single video. And she loves... She loves the game room, so... That's a shame, though, because those were, like, mint condition. Hey everyone, I am back with another pickups video. This is the pickups I found at thrift stores in the month of August 2018. Uh, so this is more than just game related. I, it's anything that I've picked up at a thrift store I'm going to show you today. First up is Mario & Luigi Bowser's Inside Story on the Nintendo DS. may know who go game hunting at thrift stores if a game's not behind glass or in a counter or something um, a lot of the times like DS games the game's gone but that's okay I got it for free if this happens and you find a case and you're still interested in the case uh, you can just take it up there and ask them and they will probably give it to you for free that's what usually happens a penny board. Not only a penny board, but the glow-in-the-dark penny board. So, I got it for six bucks. So next up is, I got this for Brittany, the crazy cat lady. She looks absolutely insane. She got a little cat in her pocket. Pick this up for two bucks. So it's important to know on the pricing of these things that I use video game price charts or I use the uh, sole completed section of eBay. Twisted Metal, head on for the PSP. Pick this up for $250. A fun holographic Mario Tennis puzzle. I picked this up for one dollar. The box is over there somewhere. And the fun part of buying used puzzles is they're always half assembled in the box. Next we have Alone in the Dark on the Xbox 360. Now this version has the soundtrack. It's got the Dublé discs. Mario Party 8 on the Nintendo Wii. All these discs are beautiful, by the way. I picked this up for eight bucks. Next up, Matrix, Path of Neo on the original Xbox. Got 
Got this for a dollar fifty. Also for a dollar fifty, I got Burnout Revenge on the PlayStation DOS. Next up is Okami on the PlayStation 2. Not only a fun game, but a beautiful game. I paid $2.50 for this. Then we have Donkey Konga on the Nintendo GameCube. I paid two fifty for this. And it doesn't come with the bongos, and I don't have the bongos, but this game was in great condition, and uh, now I can just look for the bongos and try to pair them. Then I picked up City Builder on the Nintendo Wii. City Builder on the Nintendo Wii. I got this for $2.50. This random piece of artwork. I was advised when it comes to going thrift. <laughs> I was advised when it comes to going to thrift store shopping, to always consider picking up original paintings. Now this is original, and it's got some age on it too. Um, it's got a little signature there. Can't read it. It's got some writing on the back. Can't read that. Maybe Brittany can help me translate it. But I got this for seventy-five cents. It's got a, a, a man coming out of the, the thicket. Now here's something that you all are going to care about. A silverware organizer that expands. <laughs> Made out of authentic bamboo. Now I got this, $3.99. Hmm. But Brittany wanted one, yeah. Next I picked up Mystic Series Two-Sided Jigsaw Puzzle. I got this for $1.50. Next up, I got Resident Evil 3 Nemesis on the PlayStation Uno. It is the Greatest Hits version, which is fine, because I have the black label already. If you go game hunting, you always know to check the inside of the case, which I did at the thrift store. But, to my disappointment, inside was C12, Final Resistance. I talked him down to 150 on this. All the other PlayStation 1 games were 250, which I thought was a little expensive. You know, if you go go, go you know, if you go game hunting, it can be a little stressful. Traffic stresses me out. I'm looking through the CDs at a thrift store and I'm looking for the PlayStation 1 games that might be peppered in there. Occasionally I'll pick up a, a CD to listen to and then if I don't like it or get scratched, I just throw it away. It's not a big deal. I do have Spotify on my phone, but you know, you have to download stuff, it takes up your phone's memory, slows it down, yada yada yada. 
to bring me to a zen place. Bamboo dreams. It's like a Chinese orchestra. Last, lastly and not leastly, is Stankonia by Outkast. <laughs> yeah. I paid 50 cents for this. I can tell you right now, it's priceless. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed my thrift store pickups. Tune in next month. At the end of every month, I try to post something to see what I got. Sometimes I skip a month. Mm, I'm usually consistent. Uh, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. And protect your games. If you have cats, keep the boxes up. Keep them up. Anyway, see you in the next one, guys. Bye.